All right, well, never mind. I jumped the gun. Might be, guys. All righty then. in winner's finals with DSG Paradigm versus OES Elden. And I apologize I not working quite fast enough for you guys to change this thingy. And here we go. Oh my goodness. Why can't why can't I just center things? Simple and OBS. That'd be great. Just let me center things. With ease, please. Alright, I guess that's gonna work. And so far, Eldon does not seem phased by this Charizard one bit. Just just camping him out, spacing him out with the Lula, making it just so difficult for Charizard to even get in. But that was a very nice option with Rock Smash just to get the damage. Utilizing the uh, super armor a bit. And the dash attack is going to take Luma and Rosaline off stage. And this man's going deep for the forward throw on the stretcher. Paradigm answering quite quickly. But he has to be careful. That shield is looking really low right now because of, the, because of Luma. And that should just be enough. And Elden will take that stock. We go, just gotta be careful. Just grabbing it. Oh, well, there you go. Oh, man. And Elden already racking up the quick 26%, but it will lose Luma. So here it comes. Oh, nice snare. Oh, trying to go for the hard punish, but gets grabbed punished. There we go. This man's going deep, and Luma is back. Guess it. Gonna have to pull off a little bit back and we'll get rid of Luma. Yes, going for the dunks and does not get it. That's a re. And it's not. Oh, that's weird. And that's a down smash. And Trevor taking the first game of winners' finals. This man has dropped Mario for the superior Pokemon. I don't know why it's so superior. I got to that camera is all out of whack. That camera is like tearing through. Three, two, the, uh, one, go. There you go. That's much better looking. And, but let's, let's not get too ahead of ourselves now. This is a best three out of five now for the winner's final set. And with the counter pick being Town and City, Elden's going to look to try and kill off the top a lot earlier than usual. Utilizing the shorter blast zone on the ceiling. So far, he's just having a hard time actually just getting the punt. Oh man, I thought he was gonna take. Oh, whips it. Here we go. Still 94%, but it's the same position that Paradigm was in before. But without the platforms right now, I don't think he's gonna be able to pull off the same shenanigans he did in game one to take that first stock. Here we go, Luma. Just the star bits coming out. And the star bits are gone as Luma will get blasted off into the top. And 90, 138. Gotta be careful though, as that up smash, even with, well, I don't know if that was with or without Luma. Luma is back though. And gone like the wind. Nice fair punishes. 
Oh, trying to go for the force match, but gets hit by that late hitbox. Back here coming out strong. Going for it. And Elden will be able to get back on the stage. And this craziness is... Chris, was that? Luma jab. The shield pressure is really handsome. Get shield poked. The jungle game coming out right now. Back here. Flare Blitz. Good option, but as we all know, he will take damage because of that. But still, able to get back on the stage. Just avoiding everything that Elden is throwing at him right now. Oh, the bullet shield that is Luma taking that Flare Blitz for her, for her mother. For the mama. Oh, and that's going to take it. Evening the set count, 1-1. Yeah, dude, Trevor went off that first game. Trevor Trevor threw this man off the off the stretcher. Alright, so here we go. Elden Paradigm Game 3 Winners Finals. Paradigm's counter pick is going to be Lilac, which as we know is Elden's least favorite stage. And maybe not just Elden, maybe the majority of Rosalina's as the Lilac tilt will occasionally mess up her recovery entirely if the Rosalina and Luma player is not wary. So far, it's a fairly even game as Paradigm will take the lead and get rid of Luma. 8% lead so far, so just the jab grab and trying to get something out. Applying pressure like he should be. You gotta rack up as much damage and enforce as much fear into your opponent when they lose Luma. And there we go. Playing his spark, just getting rid of Luma. Taking a little bit of damage, but he can afford to do it. He is Charizard. He has the clear weight advantage. There we go. Elden just enforcing his authority right now from the ledge. And we'll get Luma back. And here we go. Gonna take Luma on a ride off. Just like that, we have an even game. 110 for both players. Oh man, just these. Wow, Fortier is gonna take it. Grace Charizard is real. And the super armor from the Rocks match, just throwing it out there, not caring at all. He knows he can afford to take a little bit of damage, but can't afford to take that down air as he will lose the stock. Here we go, nice dash attack to get to punish the uh, get up. Here we go, this 52% already. Yeah, it's on. I was say we might have a. Oh my goodness. I was gonna say we might have Sammy commentary coming, but nah, he's just gonna smack it around. It in complete control. He's waiting. He's waiting. He wants the back air and just not. At, oh, that's it. Wait, and Trevor goes up 2-1 right now. The good patience there. Elden was Elden was kind of screwed to get from the get-go, not taking. As he will punish just the neutral get-up with that up smash and takes this game four. Takes it to game four with the 2-1 lead. Can Elden bring it back? Or are we gonna have a Charizard in Grand Finals? As we will go to FT for Elden's counter pick, utilizing the fact that there are no platforms. So it's gonna be very hard for heavy characters like Charizard to land against Rosalina as already racking up a quick 62%. Just racking it up more and more. But get air dodges, but you can't avoid that up smash. And That's just... Wild. All right, and Luma is gone. Let's see what Trevor can do as he will get just the down throw. Nothing else to confirm from it. He gets forward throw off stage. And oh, I'm trying to get ledge, but the player's going to smack him away. And here we go. A roll reversal as so far as Paradigm controlling center. Being patient, but gets smacked by that forward smash. Not enough to take the stock just yet, though. But here we go. Elden at the ledge. Just terrifying with the Luma. 
and try to go for fly. That's going to be an easy up smash punish for Elden. Driver, I would have done the same thing. Yeah. Ah. So I had to get my hydration going. Oh, and the fair is coming out. No rage at all. Melee Sheik has been reincarnated as Charizard, apparently, in Smash 4. Killing at like 80%. And the Rock Smash! And the, he's, he's, trying to, he's trying to do this. He can do the upset right now. It's possible. But Ellen is not trying to let that happen. Just, oh, oh. Oh my goodness, and Luma should be back any second now. And there she is right there, matching Rosalina with the blue. Oh, Bowser jumps away, just gets away from it. He has to be careful. Luma will kill if he's not careful at 129. Oh my goodness, 140. Can't get in against this Luma. <gasps> no! Oh my goodness, a down smash. He's going for it. Oh my goodness. Oh, the smash is going to take it. Oh. <laughs> Trevor feeling that one. It is 2-2. Two, two. Who is going to take this set? It is anyone's set right now. Game 5. We have top 5 versus like... Bottom 10. Oh, yeah. Yeah, just the characters, man. Yo, I have a theory that Foster wants top 15 because he knows he's not going to make top 10 this season. Anyways. I don't know about that. His actually helped him. Yeah. He got 9. He has, like, a lot of PR ones. Crescent and all. Yeah, he beat Crescent. Shout out to him. Crescent can throw out the John that you know is like I didn't have. Actually, now that I think about it, I think they put yeah they played on the one set that had no lag. Yeah, but I mean he still it's still. I that all of his set, um, sets were on his set. Like it's still a valid. It's it's a valid John. Like playing on lagless monitors and playing on laggy monitors is such a big difference. Five milliseconds is a hell of a huge difference, man. But anyways, back to the match as Elden. Elden's not trying to lose. As, he's ruining the fun. Yeah, he's ruining the fun. You know, he's just trying to get a paycheck. This man is just he's not he's not letting he's not letting Trevor in at all. Oh my goodness. Reads the reads the get up. And wow, that's just the last hit of Rock Smash. You gotta be careful though. So you gotta be careful about that Luma. <laughs> always, always be patient. But ultimately, down there, he's gonna take that first stock. As Eldon's looking to take him and Rosalina Luma. Damn, Luma just got smacked into the blast zone. I'm trying to punish the air dodges, but this, this goddess is too much. There we go, just standard Rosalina, bread and butter, trying to come down with the Rock Smash to avoid in the knockback. <laughs> Tries to go for fly. I mean, it was a good option. If it didn't work, if it would have hit, that might have taken the stock. Why, Star? Trevor, I told you, Charizard was <laughs> Charizard does not win his matchup, Sammy. I don't care what you say. Sammy's crazy. But so is Elden taking the set with the forest smash as he will advance the grand finals on winner's side. As we will have, I do believe it will be, come on, where's my bracket? Where's my bracket at? 